Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. Welcome to Morals in Minutes. I am Muhammad Ali and today we will talk about the importance of helping a human brother. A person is either your brother in faith or equal in humanity. This golden saying is narrated by the commander of the faithful Ali ibn Abi Talib, peace be upon him, in the famous book titled The Peak of Eloquence. Truly and most certainly these words by the Imam provide to us the pinnacle of wisdom. From this narration alone we are able to derive wonders. We see that Islam has spoken about humanity and equality between humans thousands of years ago. On the outside we might all look different but on the inside we run the same organ system and same fluid system. Henceforth Islam has placed a high emphasis on the believers when it comes about taking care of your fellow brother and catering to his needs. The Holy Messenger of Allah peace be upon him and his family says, People are dependent of Allah for sustenance. So the most beloved one to Allah is the one who is helpful to the dependents of Allah and makes the family members of a house happy. These narrations span all kinds of people since we can apply these words of the commander of the faithful, peace be upon him, on the people. Furthermore, in another tradition narrated on the authority of the Prince of Martyrs, Abu Abdullah al Hussein, peace be upon him, he said, Verily, the procession of people's needs towards you is from among the blessing of Allah upon you. Therefore, grieve not because of these blessings. This narration should be spread amongst all because it's charged with beautiful teachings. Imam al-Hussein, peace be upon him, here paints us a picture and informs us that people's need towards you is about from the blessing of Allah and that we should not grieve but thank Allah. Not anyone is willing to give their hands to help someone up except those with kind love and compassion in their hearts. If only we would act upon these three narrations, especially the first one by the commander of the faithful, peace be upon him, we wouldn't see the problems we have today, since it would end poverty, pride, envy and all other sins that lead us to say, I am better because I'm such and such. Let us raise our hands in prayer to Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala so that he may rid us sin and ask him to give us the divine guidance to enact the golden saying of the commander of the faithful, peace be upon him. Wassalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.